at the beginning, Bitcoin Core, for example, was doing everything at once. It was like, uh, I don't, I don't remember, but I think, uh, like Satoshi tried, tried to create a marketplace on it or like a poker game on it. Then you could mine as well with Bitcoin Core. You could, you could have your wallets, uh, uh with all your hotkey on Bitcoin Core. Basically, it was a all in one software. And as the industry mature, what we're seeing is that all those features that was all in one in the past are become way more and more specialized. So right now, for example, what is a Bitcoin wallet? It's a very hard question to answer. Before it was obvious it was Bitcoin Core. Yeah. And that's it. Now, Bitcoin wallet, it's like there is a bit, there is a UTXO tracker. A UTXO tracker is a different piece of software than a hardware wallet. And the hardware wallet is a different piece of software than actually the UI wallet that you will use to access your coin. So like right now, for, for example, just for the feature of one wallet, you might be using three or four different Bitcoin software instead of one. And uh, what we're seeing is that instead of having all developers focusing on their effort on, on one software, we are, we are seeing all those features that split away from, from the Bitcoin implementation node because I, I think it's natural, you know, like when it becomes bigger and bigger, it's, it's harder and harder to develop on top of it. So it's natural that some other project try to, you know, take some support of this massive blob of functionality and try to implement it better in a way more specialized project. And I think it's more, it's how developers are moving over time, like as, as the industry mature. And I think it's, it's, it's not only true on development. I think it's, uh, it's true in, uh, any technology related, uh, improvements. It's, it, it's really the special, the special, the, how do you call that? A division of labor. Uh, division, division mm -hmm. of labor. Yeah.